Hey guys, welcome back to Archangel RC. Now, after my review of the uh, Volantix Pilot X Flight Stabilizer, quite a few people, I'm guessing, bought it. And also, a few people asked if I can make a setup video because the instructions in Chinese are really not that clear. And I'm guessing, and it's natural, people have some issues getting uh, this set up. Now, first of all, you, you need to connect from the re receiver only ground and 5 volts and then just connect single cables to the different pins uh, on the flight uh, stabilizer if you don't have S-Bus. That's it. You don't need to connect 3 wires for each channel. So, I'm starting this as if it's a brand new uh, flight stabilizer. You will not be able to control the servos uh, from the get-go. So, first thing you do, uh, you have to disconnect power if you have it connected to the stabilizer. Then you have to press the uh, button on it while plugging in the battery and hold your finger there for a few seconds. When you let go, the blue dot, the blue LED will uh, start blinking and the first red LED will light up. That means it's in calibration mode. You have to uh, now calibrate the uh, stick endpoints. So this plane only has ailerons and elevator. So move the sticks easily from one extreme to the other extreme. And don't forget the mode uh, changing cha uh, channel. So move that as well. Uh, the throttle here is passed through on this uh, stabilizer. So don't uh, mess with that. You hold the button for three seconds until the red LED changes to the second one. And in this mode now, it's uh, level calibration for the flight stabilizer. Uh, you can also check the direction of the, uh, of the controls. And don't move it in this stage. Just move both sticks to the bottom right to save the settings. And after 7 seconds, all three LEDs will uh, go out. And at this point, you need to unplug the battery. Otherwise, the stabilization will not work. You need to unplug the battery and plug it back in to restart the flight stabilizer. While the blue LED is blinking, don't move it. When it stops blinking, it's ready for use. Now you can move the sticks around and verify that they're moving in, that the control surfaces are moving in the right directions. Uh, you can also check if the stabilizer is stabilizing in the right directions. If it rolls right, if, it, if you roll the plane uh, to the right, it has to move the control surfaces in such a way as to try to push it back to the left and stabilize it. Uh, same goes for up and down. So verify it. And if, and that's about it, if everything's okay, uh, the controls are moving in the right direction, the stabilizing uh, looks proper. That's it. If you have a channel that is reversed, uh, you need to, uh, you, you actually need to reverse it in the radio to fix it, to go in the proper way. And then you need to do the calibration again with that channel working the proper way. So make sure you don't miss anything. And, uh, that's about it. It's a simple setup. If you have any questions, uh, put them in the comments below. Please subscribe, like this video if you found it useful, and I will see you soon.